All right. We're not seriously flying into that. You say the weather patterns of Seknarf 9 are tied to the temperament of its ruler. That's not how women work. Or weather. Anyways, I'm sure it looks worse than it is. No, it's worse. Two minutes without these guys just roasting me alive. <laughs> Piece of cake. <sighs> you can't be serious. What? This way we can scope things out before we finish the transaction. We're like a hundred clicks from her base. You know how much I like scoping. Nope. Okay. All right. Next time, I'm flying. Monsters do not fly ships. Monsters do whatever they want. Close the damn fridge. Don't you get all gloomy right now. Don't help. Because you're constant complaining, Daz? <laughs> you, you are complaining about the short one complaining. We're all complaining. Happy? Feel free to pause and read this if you guys need to. I'll read it back after our edit. The rocket's room is disgusting. This thing looks so sinister. Hey, who said you could touch that? I don't go into your room and touch your stuff, Quill. What? You hacked my visor and added a scoreboard to it while I was sleeping. Eh, that was different. I improved it. Also, did anyone tell you that you snore? I thought Drax was bad, but wow. Quill, you should really get that checked. You sound like a torg. I don't snore that loud <laughs> yeah okay so what is this thing anyway kind of looks like a metal base hugger that is clearly a spinal control unit yes right of course a, a spinal control thingy back on half world Cree scientists use these to keep us super soldiers in line uh, they'd press a big fun red button and zap instant obedience Holy crap. Rocket. Super soldiers. How many of you super soldiers were there on Half World? When the Kree started, a hundred, maybe. By the time I escaped, just me and Lila. She was the first one not to die from the control unit. And Lila is also a. What? A raccoon? Or not a raccoon? You gotta understand. She was afraid of them, and the control unit made sure we stayed in line, that I stayed in line. Oh, that sounds... awful. I can't imagine. So, I did what I do best. I found a way to overload the control unit. When the Blueskins let us out of our cage, kaboom! <laughs> I blew a hole into the side of the lab. What we didn't know... What I didn't know was that the lab was protected by sentry bots. We got to the security fence and Lila covered me while I hacked the modulator frequency and uh, as soon as it opened, she pushed me through the door. I heard a die quill. Oh, that rocket. That sucks. Doesn't matter now. Past is the past, right? And that thing, it's just a reminder. What exactly did the Kree do to you? They ripped me apart and rebuilt me over and over and over again until I became this half-finished thing they could mold and shape and control. Oh, Rocket, I had no idea. I mean, I knew the Kree Empire was desperate, but... Do you know what it's like to lose all control of your body? To be in constant pain, trapped inside yourself, and able to stop the horrible things you're doing? 
that that control unit made sure I did what I was supposed to do. Oh, yeah, whether I wanted to or not. <laughs> A neat, furry little machine of death. Didn't take long to figure out I was better off not fighting it. Okay. And let's shoot this thing out the airlock. Have a little middle finger salute ceremony to the bastards who built it. Uh, yeah. I don't think I'm ready to let go of that part of me yet. Maybe one day. Are you 100% sure you want to keep it? What if it controls me? Eh, I decided a long time ago, Quill, that I would never let anyone control me again. As far as I'm concerned, this is just another useful piece of junk and a few bad memories. I'm... Sorry, you had to go through all that rocket. For real. Hmm. That's that's some deep stuff right there. Bet we could have made some money if we'd stopped by nowhere first. Will you please stop? I can't believe I'm about to say this, but how about some positivity for Groot? Let's hey, buddy. Shit. I was Quill just the good uh, sense to checking my loot to see if everything was okay. Started nosing around and the no, it that sounds better. Is I sense there is more okay. coming. It sure would be nice if I could use oh. those parts to upgrade our weapon systems, though. Too bad what? this translator's I guess the busted. I was hoping it might have root stored so on it. Almost or had it. <laughs> that way, I could download it into my translator. I'd love to know what your thoughts are on stuff without, you know. Rocket always filtering it. I am Groot. You know, I didn't always have a translation implant. I mean, I was failing Spanish before I left Earth, not that Spanish would have prepared me for all of this. I am Groot. Man, those first few years, do you know how hard it was to get by without having any idea what people were saying? Half the languages out here sound like white noise, weird birds, and messed up theremins. <laughs> I don't even want to know what Rocket actually sounds like. <laughs> TV did not prepare me for the realities of living in space, let me tell you. Honestly, man, you're lucky you have Rocket. I mean, I know what it's like to be surrounded by people and have no one understand you how... Lonely that can be I'd have been lost You must have been lost too before rocket and and us I, am I Probably don't say this enough, but you really are an important part of the team I can't imagine the gardeners of the galaxy without Groot and who knows if this thing does have your language in it and rocket can download it somehow or hack it or I don't know It'd be nice to finally talk to you. For real. Actually, hold that thought. Yo, Rocket! What? Can you come here for a sec? What do you want, Quill? I'm busy. Think you can see if this translator has Groot's language on it? It doesn't. You didn't even check. Don't need to. Cheap scut like that don't have rare language packages. And even if it did, it's beyond salvageable. Really? Wait, you have Groot's language package installed in your translation implant? Do I look like I'm made of units? Only folks who got that language package are rich people. So you actually speak Groot then? You mean Talinism? And yeah, I speak it, more or less. Me and Groot been bounty hunting together for a decade before you came along, Quill. When you've been working together that long, you develop a common understanding. I am Groot. You say misunderstandings, I say open to interpretation. I am Groot. They didn't go sour. We didn't need those jobs anyway. <laughs> so you guys learn to understand each other over time. And with the help of a spreadsheet of Groot's lexicon, which ain't no easy feat when your entire language sounds like I am in Groot. So there's hope for us yet. I am Groot. Glad we had this little chat. I am Groot. Awesome. Cool. Didn't understand a single word that man said, but... Right. Took some time to get to know the Guardians and stuff. Set out. Okay, here we go. 
I ever mentioned how much I hate rain? Hellbender's castle isn't even that far. Oh, that's that's pretty far off. Awesome. Impregnable fortress. So Why can't we fly closer? Ask Peter. <laughs> Let's just get closer. We'll figure it out on the way. There is nothing to figure out. As beast merchants, we will easily gain access to Lady Hellbender. Good. We've already got a beast. All that's left is the merchant part. Good thing I put on my official merchant costume. There is no such thing. Out. Hey, is my jacket all right? At least you got a jacket. Some of us are soaking here. Less whining, more walking. Hey, Stormlord, we ain't seriously walking through this. It'll take forever in this storm. Stop complaining. The hardship will strengthen your spirit. We won't walk. We'll hike. It'll be fun. Woohoo! Team hiking trip. We got this. Just don't fall and we'll be fine. Agreed. The Space Lady Hellbender's range head on. Almost sounds like you want to get hit by lightning. I would not expect a Chitauri trainer to understand the underlying value. The underlying value of getting killed? Of being direct, you child of subterfuge. What is All right. the problem? Oh, damn. scoffs upon duplicity and dishonor. Your reputation is why she tests us. Can we refocus here? We're here to trick some lady. Oh, shit. That was way too close. Well played, Lady Hellbender. So we're still doing this? Yes! There's some materials down here. I wasn't cowering, I was getting some loot. Stop bullying me. Guys! Focus! Keep an eye out on those big blue ones and take cover when they hit. Or you we'll get blown rocket, right you off. son of a bitch. He just knocked you off the damn map. Oh, this wind is blowing us too. Oh crap. Holy crap, dude. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh, okay, that's what's causing the wind. Right. Oh shit. Oh no, 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 no. Shit. Okay, that was supposed to happen. Ooh. Everyone okay? We should have gone to Maku 4. Hey, check out the old resistance ship. Things been shot to hell. No doubt by this one and her Chitauri friend. We weren't friends. Uh, guys. The hell is that? Eh, not sure. But it ain't moving now. We'll be wary, Rodin. Uh, you know, when I survive freaking half world, I think I'm scared of some little. Bit. What? It's not alone. Get ready. Got some QB boys. This should get interesting. Oh, 
That's a big one right there. Over here. Spikes are incoming. I'll take your word on that. I slice off these and it grows back. What is next, Peter Quill? Back, destroy, perish. The aggressive move these guys down. Ah, I always mess up the freaking active reload, dude. around here looks like we are outside lady hellbender's sanctuary the creatures here are not her pets food. they sort of do look like food we're gonna be food if we don't climb out of here where the flark is she going no spells shoot stuff there's a trail going through the jungle drax you could pull this reactor out gently right if it were combustible the rodent would have shot it by now he makes an excellent point now i continue ripping it apart no 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 i think we're good this husk should be easier to climb than the muddy terrain i ain't comfortable calling it a husk i'm going to scout ahead try not to kill yourselves all right rocket that wind control panel's all yours hope it still works great Everyone watch out for beeping red lights. What? Why? This is a resistance ship. We'll be lucky if there's only one booby trap on it. That don't sound like no jelly thing. They say that Lady Hellbender's call echoes throughout the planet. That don't sound like no lady either. Careful! Looks like something big moved through here. Yay! If you see anything with claws the size of... Let me guess. Some kind of monster thing. Good guess. Well done. Any chance it doesn't know we're here? Nope. Only question is, which one of us it'll jump first? It's probably not gonna jump us. Mm-hmm. I hope not. Ooh, mysterious. Found something well. Yeah, some kind of cave. Maybe it's got hidden treasure. Uh, Ooh, yep. Uh, I see an outfit back there. Here. And hello, mystery goo. Monster eggs. Yay. Okay, so note to self. If it looks like a monster cave and smells like a monster cave... No, just trying to stay ready. Some materials. Something's screeching in here. Yeah, there it is. Okay. How do I get back there? I guess I have to go in this little back area right here. See, this is why we explored. Find freaking outfits and shit. Oh, shit.
trying not to die. Got here. Oh shit. Got Gamora's Guardians out. Oh, yeah, we're definitely swapping that on for sure. No hesitation. Guardians of the Galaxy 2014. Oh, shit, what the fuck? You done exploring, Quill? Because uh, I really need to talk to you. Hey, what's up, Rocket? Alright, man, what's up? Look. There's no easy way to say this, so I'll just say it. I think I'm dying, Quill. Wait, what? Even with all these freaking augmentations and shut knows what else I, I just... I need to know that you'll take care of Groot for me. I had no idea, man. Does Groot know? No. No, no, no. And, uh, you can't tell him. It'll destroy him. If the day comes that I... Just promise me you'll take care of Groot. I promise. And, uh, are you in that, uh, are you messing with me? What the f you son of a bitch. Uh, you know, say you'll bury me <laughs> in the, in the Milano. Rocky, you son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, I can't believe your face. It was like, I, I can't even describe your freaking face. Come on, no, I'm, I'm, don't talk to me anymore, Rocky. Right? The sooner we can focus on paying that stupid fine. Easy for you to say. You ain't the one getting auctioned out. What's he got? Uh, Gamora's outfit. All we need is this Drax, Rocket, and Star Wars outfits from the movie. <laughs> yeah, I bet you are. You sure you want to get lost out here? Relax. I'm just looking around. Oh shit. Time we have wanted. Can you get us through here, Gamora? Whatever it takes to find help, Ender. That scared the shit out of me. We'll need to find a way out of this jungle. Why? It's dry down here. Wouldn't you rather sweat than walk? Not particularly. and it melts in your mouth. Uh, now where he goes? Hey, Quill! You out laying your eggs or something? That is not how Terrans reproduce. Not how most Terrans reproduce. That's what makes our Quill so special. Interesting. I don't lay eggs. Hmm. Looks more... Uh, dead end. That's just great. Hmm. Wait, is that Chitauri tech over there? Ask Chitauri. No, no, it is. It's a retractable bridge. They used them at the prison I was in. Too bad the controls are on the other side of the giant chasm. We what do you do not have time to dawdle in this jungle? I shall hurl the creature over the chasm so I may activate a hole through your face. Put me down. No, uh, don't We're do not that, Jax. Rocket. Very well. You sons of forking chogs. How will we cross? Don't face <laughs> Look around. We'll find another way. We can't be throwing our freaking teammates around. That's jacked up. My problem was me had trying to hug me over. Not a stick. You were overreacting. I did not throw you. 
We were getting ready to. There should be no problem. I'm watching you. What's Jatari Tech doing on a... Perhaps Lady Hellbender will tell me we're dating Swarm, and it was among the spoils. There has to be something we can use. Maybe a tall tree? <laughs> Taller than Groot. Wow! It is dark in here! If you bump into any monsters, let us know! Monster planet! Right! Think these statues are of the monsters on this planet? They're made of rock. You do know that aimless shooting isn't gonna scare the monsters away, right? Hey! My shooting's not aimless! Everything I do is with purpose and, you know, heroism. Hey, I found more ruins down here. He knocked that over, Drax. Bro, that, are you are you good? Dude? I may have angered them. Them? We're being hunted. Right. All right. Let's try not to fall. That's your pet talk. Great place to leave a skull. Wait. You hear that? Nice up, people. What the fuck is that? Fucking monster things! Everyone get ready! I see that sword! Cut to the chase! Watch the stingers! Do not watch! Destroy! Ah, oh, fuck, I missed one. There we go. Oh, I thought I dodged that in time. Shit. Oh, I'm getting fucked up. Peter Quill, I have rescued you. I was almost cut there. Thanks, Peggy. Fuck off. Holy crap. I got fucked up. All right. I'm not sure the best way to take those guys down. I'm not sure if they're weak. I guess maybe staggering them. They do a lot of damage. Right, let's try this again. There we go. Oh yeah, you definitely want to do the stagger bar on these guys. Okay. Let's get that. Be able to fly around and shoot. 
I'm sure that could come in handy at some point. Where the flock are we? Just look around. There must be a path here somewhere. All right, Gamora. I'm pretty sure it's this way. 50 units as it ain't. No way are we almost there. Still got like half a planet to walk across. Lady Hellbender could cross this jungle in seven strides. Sure she could. Or she would have flown over the mountains. Oh, she flies now. I heard she shoots lasers out of her eyes. Now we're talking. Uh, I have not heard that one. I heard there are actually nine of her. More am I cutting us a path? They say that Lady Hellbender feels it every time you cut a piece of her jungle. An old Nova bomber. I haven't seen one of these since the war. I remember it used to take a dozen ships to bring one down. A dozen ships. Or one Chitauri infantry. I'll take that one as a compliment. Still no sign of the fortress? Nope. Now what's the hold up? Fear. No. Just thinking someone else should cross the death uh, okay, that was cool. Being brood of the merchandise. Only one of you is just go. No, you just go. go. Don't leaders usually cross first? Not if it's dangerous. Because I need to cover everyone. Right. See, it's fine. Perfectly safe. Fine. Do not even think of pushing the assassin. There are so many better ways to kill someone. I mean, she's not wrong. Easy does it. Oh shit. What the fuck is that? The Groot says there's something down there. It doesn't matter. Of course it matters. It's unstable either way. Just move. Oh, hell on that. Oh, fuck. Dude, why was it C? Thank you, Gamora. Bro, I was not expecting it to be C. That threw me off. Nice catch. You're welcome. Don't get used to it. Got to get more globby boys. I got it. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, health marker. Some enemies have multiple health bars. It's indicated by a marker about the gauge. All right. Stagger, there you go. Fuck him up. to trigger a call to action attack. Fuck him up. Oh shit, fuck you too. Ooh, a couple enemies, alright, nice. Oh, there he goes. Cowardly beast, finish the battle! Aw, Stumpy's running away. Stumpy. That its tail between its legs. I say we go after it. Finish the job. Anyone ever tell you you're scary? Yes. I mean, there's obviously a way out up there, which is exactly what we need. Plus, it'll give us eyes on where we need to go. And it is settled. Let's scale this down for traffic. Yeah. Okay. 
How do we do that? Good question. Huh. Looks like there's one of those oh, vintage workbench bench things back here. That's convenient. Okay, Rocky, let's see if this thing's still. Hey, what can I make? Yeah, alright. Just better not get jumped by any monsters. Uh super quill punch. Definitely gonna need that because I'll keep getting put on my Small ass constantly. So, yeah, that's all I can do right now. So, where are we? Starting to wonder if I should be the one with a fancy visor. I wouldn't trust a thing you said. We agree for once. I too would prefer Peter Quill's incompetence to the rodent's lies. Okay, calm down. Got materials up here, sir. Okay, He's got a point. Hard enough to land uh, here. Let's scour the surface for scrap. I think I'm seeing what's happening here. Craig, you are. Gamora, how high up this thing can you climb? Let's find out. Are you relishing this moment, assassin? What moment? Visiting the grave of your enemies. No, the core weren't my enemies, Drax. They were my father's enemies. See anything useful up there? Nah. I got eyes on this gunked up Dash reactor. The A couple of shots to bring it down. All right. I'm pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. Ow. It is neither a baby nor a ticket. It is a reactor. Anything you can do with that busted reactor unit rocket? Drax, moving that Actually, thing no, around Jackson, ain't a problem, Jackson. right? It is not. Just like the mighty Lady Hellbender, I am exceptionally muscular. Okay, well, I think I see what's happening here, sir. So. unit is tremendously heavy. I thought you were exceptionally muscular. Yes! That is why I can easily carry this great weight. Do you even know where to put it? I have merely followed our leader's directions. I see. I see. Don't take too long. We got a castle to get to. Fortress. Hey, big guy, lift that thing up. Okay, I see. Put this here. Probably here. We can climb up there. You think any bodies are still in there? All mummified and stuff. What next, Peter Quill? Can you get up there now? Should only take a second. Yeah. This brings back memories! Mm. Impressive. Perfect. See? That was easy. Great teamwork, everyone. I helped in spirit. Oh, right. Slippery wind pummeled treetops. Here we come. You know, I uh, really admire our team's commitment to safety. <laughs> we are not committed to safety. What? We're safe-ish. Got some more windy areas here. Man, never realized Seknarf was such a hot spot for the war. Everywhere was a hot spot for the war. Okay, yeah. Okay, <sighs> here we go. Oh, slimy. Oh, shit. Uh, guys, you might want to wait to come down here. <laughs> Why the flark is so deep? In a jam voice? Uh, you think? Son of a smack breach! The sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, hit fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Flark, flark, flark. Uh, well. Hang on, Rocket. Okay, yeah, it wasn't a mouse man. Alright. We're good. What did you just do? Sorcery. So cold. Rocket! Somebody get him out of there! Tell me what 
it? I don't know. My blast is a... I've only done that once before when I was a kid. I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, it pulls Scott like this. Just, come to, just please the guns me, alone. Me, I, I, well, I just want to see how they tick. Otherwise, it might as well be magic. Or sorcery. Guys. Sorcery. Here we go again. Alright, here we go. Element shots. You can now equip element blaster shots. Press one to equip the ice shot. Icon above enemies health bar in the case of weakness to an element. Element gauge replenishes over time and ammo or drop by the okay. Oh shit. Settle up. Guys, huddle up. We're killing it out there, Quill. You see the look on their faces when they see you rays ring down from on high? <laughs> or the ones they make when they realize Groot's got him tied oh, up in I a bomb. I know. Bone. Never thought I'd say this, but fighting with you guys is fun. Stay focused and the fun will continue. <laughs> okay. Yes. I get that it's all bubbly and sparkly out there. We're blasting shots at them and it's so much fun. But, if we lose our focus, if we can't let go of these crazy thoughts spinning us upside down, we're done. Who's with me? Feel my rock! Can't wait to take him down! Feel it! Damage boost. Shots make that way we're easier. Close, but we're gonna need to get up there. I'm thinking we can climb up and over. Ding ding ding! Give that man a gold star. I right, can't shoot Let's that. Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. Be a planetary. Okay. There's a little hole there. Might be able to work something loose from the inside. Rocket, you could fit through that hole. Maybe hack something from the inside to make us steps. How am I supposed to even get up there? Yeah, oh, that's true. Huh. Actually. Rax, think you can drag this cannon out? I will try. It is more stubborn than expected. That did it! There we go. Impressive, Peter Quill. Now we gotta get the next rocket. I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. Oh, what reeks in here? That. Oh, Scott. Ah, ah. You okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat dead Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute the little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what? Flark it! I'm blowing it up! What? Hang on! Think about all the booby traps in... Uh-oh. I mean, it worked. Ha! Look at it go! He must have jump-started the thing. Rocket, you okay? 
Yep. And dry now, too. Gamora, can you clear us a path through that junk? Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh, so she's a giantess now. It is said that Lady Hellbender stands 50 heads tall. Hey, feel free to pause if you need to read. Doesn't tell you much. Depends who's head. Ever met a regalia? Oh man. Another murder tentacle. Careful. Shit. It might be playing dead. Whoa. Oh shit. That is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Back to its brood mother, Lady Hellbender. Oh. Hey, you think they look like a bunch of tiny rockets trying to get out of the rain? on the wrong side this time i insist we hurl the foul beast and i insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff to what end yours no don't throw How rocket many times do i have to say it? we're not throwing rocket ridiculous you were holding us back to spare the beast's feelings when has he done the same for us put him down just be less tamed. oh i'll show you what a lesson looks like Knock it off, guys! We're supposed to be professionals. We're better than this. I'm not. Letting a measly Chitauri installation stop our progress is unprofessional. Then stop wasting time arguing. We'll find another way across. We're supposed to be a team over here trying to murder each other. The fortress is this way, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just doing some exploring. Yeah, I feel like. There's definitely something back here, and there is, so. sure exploring is code. It means he went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. They're just constantly making fun of me, and it makes me sad, man. Shouldn't we at least have a lead? Ah. That's dope. See my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks yeah, just like scouting. We, uh, need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work, Peter. I sure hope that buttless beast ain't running back to mommy to tell on us. Gotta aim for its head tomorrow. At least I took an appendage. What did you do? Hey, that thing is like seriously bruised. In fact. It wouldn't surprise me if it just keeled over and died somewhere in the jungle after all that damage I caused. You think it died of excessive bruising? Guys, I've got something here. It's deep. This looks promising. There's little room to maneuver if something should attack. You're not gonna... Yep. Definitely something gross behind here. Drax, can you chuck that through the stink wall? I fear I will regret this. Uh, that is disturbing me, Frank. Yeah. Uh, uh, I am clinching every orifice right now. Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Uh, because it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter. Why would it taste like that? I can use this. You know, we really got monster work food? on your taste. Monster the cage. Food. You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our... With our monster peacefully walking beside us, we'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you whispering? Yeah, why are we whispering right now? Who more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage? Only problem is there's a pissed off monster inside. 
Release the beast. Let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety is needed. All right. But there's Stumpy. Stumpy's back. Are we gonna fight both of them? Oh shit. I just dodge off the picking cliff. Uh, Re-hold them down. Oh. Nope, the ice does absolutely nothing to him. Stagger bar up. Let Kumara finish him off. Nope, I forgot he has this special life. There's an outfit up there. I hate this Larkin planet. You hate everything, Rocket. True, but especially the stinky slime tunnel part. Itchy fur is where I draw the line. Hey, I just went through the same crap you did, and I smell amazing. Ah, sure you do. It's my sexy hero, Musk. <laughs> Deep freeze. Whoa, can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. With the monster queen. How much are we asking for our monster? 395 million units, give or take two. Group, give me a bridge here. 395 million. Right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. For you, maybe. I love it. Adversary indeed. Lady Hellbender isn't her adversary. If all goes yes. well, there's an outfit up here that I want. And if all don't go well, then we'll know we should have sold Groot instead. And I want it. Gimme, 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 gimme. What is it? Five horsemen of the apocalypse. Ooh, that looks spooky. I, I just kind of want to rock the. Movie outfits. Never heard of roads. You'd have to clear parts of the jungle to do it, which would probably mean killing some of the wildlife. Good. They deserve it. Zekhov 9 is a sanctuary. They say that if you leave behind a single piece of refuge, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you. Most unpleasant way. That can't be true. Whoa, that is definitely in my top ten fortresses. That actually looks pretty dope. What the flark? You said that quarantine zone monster was supposed to be rare. She already 
has a whole herd of them? So we wasted our time. Almost got killed for nothing. And got arrested. That was fun. It was moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? That would have sucked big time. Exactly. If we even got that far, what if we've been towing that thing when Novacore intercepted us? They would have taken our beast. See? Yeah. This is Let's just get this done. Farther. It's a flark in infinity bridge, is what it is. Are oh, you being dramatic, Rodent? The bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you? Oh, right. The cage. The point of even getting the flark at things is looking like we mean business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him. You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Remind show me again. Pitch. How many missions have we been on so far? Thirteen. Fourteen, if you count contracts. Contraxia was not a mission. It was a mistake. All right. Point is, is I was able to sell you, Gamora. Daughter of Thanos, intergalactic assassin. As a hero. 14 times! <laughs> Fine. I think he's made his point. <laughs> Drat. Gamora, can you help me with this? No. What? Why? Alright. To guarantee your safety as our leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. You stop worrying so much, you're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Alright, looks like a good place to end. I will see you guys next time. Bye.